Hello, this is Alexander Cross, criminal defense here in the San Francisco Bay Area. If you'd like to learn more about criminal defense here in the San Francisco Bay Area, be sure to subscribe to our channel, Law Offices of Cross and Associates and ask questions in the comment section below. So we received an interesting inquiry here on our YouTube channel. This has to do with the sale of heroin to people with mental problems. Criminal attorney, Manteca. Drug attorney, Manteca. Selling drugs, Manteca. Attorney, Manteca. Let's see here. I was arrested for distributing heroin to people with mental problems, but their family members were the ones who requested and paid for it. Well, first of all, the very fact that the family members requested for it and paid for it, that's not going to be a defense to you selling heroin to people. Selling heroin is a felony. That is a violation of Health and Safety Code 11351. It carries up to four years state prison. And you can be charged for every single transaction of selling this heroin. Every single transaction is a separate one of these offenses. And the problem is that selling heroin is a straight felony. That means it's not reducible to a misdemeanor. It is a straight felony. That means it will be on your record essentially for life. And if you're you know, not a US citizen, this is a crime that would result in deportation, exclusion from the United States, and denial of naturalization. So selling heroin, that's a bit of a no-no. Now, the very fact that the people um, who were using this heroin had mental problems, that's something that will probably upset the DA. It'll probably upset the DA. And the DA will probably look to get, you know, try to, they'll try to throw the book at you. They'll try to hit you with as many charges as possible. Now, is it a separate crime to sell heroin to people who have mental problems? No, it's not a separate crime, but it's something to where the DA will be like, oh God, what a, you know, no, no, oh no. And then, you know, as opposed to maybe giving you a deal where they would normally say, well, you know, you're looking at, four years uh, state prison, maybe we can give you, uh, you know, three months county jail, six months county jail, the deal will be like, no, this guy was exploiting people with mental problems, we're going to get him, th you know, two years, three years. In other words, they're, they're just going to give you a little more. Obviously, they can't give you more than the max, but they'll give you more than what they normally would give you if you're exploiting people who have mental problems. But remember, it's a straight felony, uh, health and safety code 11351, distribution of heroin, Please don't be doing this. Even if you're not making money on it, if you're distributing heroin, that's still an 11351. And heaven forbid the police come to your house and they find a tremendous amount of heroin in your home. You, they have that, all of a sudden you, they might think that you're part of a, you know, a larger group of sellers and you could be charged federally and that's no good. Regardless, if you'd like to learn more about criminal defense here in the San Francisco Bay Area, be sure to subscribe to our channel, Law Offices of Cross and Associates, and ask questions in the comments section below so that we can respond by, by way of video. But if you've been accused of a crime and need representation in court here in the San Francisco Bay Area, call us for a free consultation at 1-800-862-7677. On our next video, we're going to be discussing the case of somebody who refused to sign for a ticket. Criminal attorney, Manteca. Sale of heroin, Manteca. Drug attorney, Manteca. Attorney, Manteca.